Okay, so now for the second part of the lab one, um, you will be given a, or you might be given a graph similar to this one, and you will be either given a percent transmittance or an absorption value. Now, if you are given the opposite of what you would expect, uh, like, you know, for example, if in this case you need to find absorbance, but you're actually given percent transmittance, well, fear not, for in the back of the test, there is an equation sheet that will give you how to how to do this transformation. So in, in this case, we have absorption equals the negative log of percent transmittance over 100. So we use that to go ahead and plug in our values. Um, so if we are given percent transmittance, we then turn that into a percent or into an absorption. And let's say we get a 0.2 absorption. Well, we go to the 0.2 and we go across until we hit our line. And then we go down and that is the concentration of whatever we're looking at. So similarly, if we are given if we are given a percent transmittance that finds an absorbance value of 0.4, we go over here to 0.4, we go across until we hit that line and then we go down and that is how you find the concentration